Office web apps are online companions to Word, Excel, and PowerPoint that make it possible to edit Microsoft Office documents virtually anywhere, directly from the browser. Business customers licensed for Microsoft Office 2010 through a volume licensing program can deploy Office web apps on-premises via SharePoint Foundation 2010 or SharePoint Server 2010. After installing to the server, this feature must be activated at the site collection level by an administrator. SharePoint end users can choose to edit Word documents, Excel spreadsheets, or PowerPoint presentations directly from the web browser. Keep in mind the Office web apps have limited functionality compared to the desktop versions. When attempting to edit a document in the browser, users are notified if the app is unable to open the file with an explanation of the reason. Let's take a look at the web apps in action. From a library, a selected document, or in this case Excel spreadsheet, can be edited directly in the browser using the option on the right-click menu. Similar to the desktop version, a limited ribbon displays across the top, offering only the tabs Home and Insert, so this is appropriate for making simple edits. I'll update the figure in cell D6, for example. Changes are immediately saved, so as you can see here, there's no need to click the Save button. In fact, there isn't one. This idea also applies to PowerPoint. While I can't modify the theme or animations, I can make simple text edits. Again, changes are automatically saved. Another way to open a document is to first select View in Browser. This gives me an idea of how the document looks. Near the top of the window, I can click Edit in Browser to modify the document. The Word app hides pictures, themes, and other formatting, but still allows me to edit the text. Changes do need to be saved with the Word app, using the Save icon or from the File tab. Well, that concludes this brief look at the Office web apps and how they integrate with Microsoft SharePoint 2010.